Greek yogurt versus kefir. What's healthier for you? This is not just a food debate. It is a health battle. On one side is Greek yogurt, thick, creamy, and high in protein. On the other side is kefir, tangy, drinkable, and loaded with probiotics. Let's start with the basics. Greek yogurt and kefir both come from milk. Both are fermented. But the way they are made is very different. Greek yogurt is made by straining regular yogurt. This removes most of the whey and gives yogurt its thick texture. The process also concentrates the protein. Kefir is made by fermenting milk with kefir grains. These are not real grains. They are clusters of bacteria and yeast living together. This is why kefir has a much wider range of probiotics compared to Greek yogurt. So even from the beginning, you can see the difference. Greek yogurt is about concentration. Kefir is about diversity. Now let's compare nutrition. One cup of plain Greek yogurt contains about 100 calories, 10 grams of protein, and 5 to 6 grams of carbs. It also has calcium, B vitamins, and some potassium. Kefir, on the other hand, has around 100 to 110 calories, 9 grams of protein, and slightly more carbs, usually 7 to 8 grams. But the key difference is probiotics. Kefir has up to 30 strains of bacteria and yeast. Greek yogurt usually has just 2 to 5 strains. That means kefir offers a much broader probiotic spectrum. A 2019 study in Frontiers in Microbiology highlighted that kefir has unique yeasts and bacteria that yogurt simply does not have. This means kefir can colonize the gut in more ways and improve microbial balance better. But does this matter for health? Yes, it does. Let's start with the gut. Your gut is home to trillions of microbes. The more diverse they are, the healthier your digestion, immunity, and even mood. Greek yogurt supports gut health with beneficial bacteria like Lactobacillus bulgaricus and Streptococcus thermophilus. Kefir goes further. It has Lactobacillus kefiranofaciens, Lactococcus lactis, and even beneficial yeasts like Saccharomyces kefir. Together, they fight harmful bacteria, reduce inflammation, and help your gut build resilience. Research published in Nutrients in 2018 showed kefir reduced bloating, improved bowel movements, and supported gut barrier function more effectively than yogurt. This makes kefir especially powerful for people with digestive issues. Now, let's talk about protein. Protein is where Greek yogurt shines. Because it is strained, its protein density is much higher. This makes it excellent for muscle repair, weight management, and satiety. A study in the Journal of Nutrition from 2015 found that Greek yogurt consumption increased muscle protein synthesis after resistance training. It also kept people fuller for longer compared to regular yogurt. Kefir, while still a good protein source, does not reach the same protein density as Greek yogurt. For athletes or people aiming to control appetite, Greek yogurt has a clear advantage here. But there's more to health than just protein. Immunity is another area we must compare. Kefir is a powerful immune booster. Why? Because its probiotics interact with immune cells in the gut. Around 70% of your immune system lies in your gut lining. Studies in Frontiers in Immunology from 2020 showed kefir can stimulate macrophages, natural killer cells, and T-cells. This means kefir doesn't just improve digestion. It trains your immune system to fight infections more effectively. Greek yogurt supports immunity too, but the diversity of kefir's microbes gives it an edge. What about lactose? Many people cannot digest lactose, the sugar in milk. Greek yogurt has less lactose than regular milk because bacteria break some of it down. Kefir goes even further. The yeast and bacteria in kefir almost completely digest lactose. A 2015 study in the Journal of Dairy Science showed kefir was well tolerated, even in people with lactose intolerance. 
This makes kefir a safer choice for people who usually experience bloating, cramps, or diarrhea after consuming dairy. Let's move to bone health. Both Greek yogurt and kefir are excellent sources of calcium, magnesium, and vitamin K2. These are critical for bone density. A large study in Osteoporosis International from 2016 linked higher yogurt intake with reduced risk of fractures in older adults. Kefir also shows strong results. Research in nutrients from 2019 found kefir supplementation improved bone mineral density in postmenopausal women. This was likely due to its probiotics increasing calcium absorption in the gut. So, in terms of bone health, both are strong contenders. Greek yogurt builds bones with protein and calcium. Kefir strengthens bones with probiotics and enhanced absorption. Now, let's discuss weight management. Greek yogurt is often considered the diet yogurt because of its high protein and low sugar. It keeps you full and helps you reduce calorie intake naturally. A 2016 study in Appetite found that people who ate Greek yogurt as a snack consumed fewer calories at their next meal. Kefir can also help with weight loss, but in a different way. Its probiotics improve metabolism, balance blood sugar, and reduce fat storage. A 2018 study in obesity research and clinical practice showed kefir reduced body weight and improved insulin sensitivity in overweight individuals. So, while Greek yogurt works by reducing hunger, kefir works by improving metabolism. We also need to compare cardiovascular health. Both Greek yogurt and kefir contain bioactive peptides that lower blood pressure. However, kefir may offer stronger protection. A study in hypertension research in 2019 showed kefir lowered blood pressure and improved endothelial function in hypertensive rats. Human studies also suggest kefir reduces cholesterol by binding bile acids in the gut. Greek yogurt helps too, but kefir's probiotic diversity makes it more effective in heart health. Another factor to consider is mental health. The gut and brain are deeply connected through the gut-brain axis. Probiotics from both yogurt and kefir can influence mood, reduce anxiety, and improve cognitive function. But once again, kefir seems more powerful. A 2020 review in Nutrients highlighted kefir's role in reducing depression and anxiety symptoms through modulation of gut bacteria. Greek yogurt can help, but kefir's complex microbial network provides stronger mental health benefits. Now, let's talk about practicality. Greek yogurt is versatile. You can eat it plain, mix it with fruits, use it in smoothies, or even cook with it. It is thick, creamy, and easy to enjoy daily. Kefir is drinkable, which makes it quick and convenient. You can drink it straight, blend it, or pour it over oats. But its tangy flavor may not appeal to everyone. This is where Greek yogurt wins for taste and versatility. But if convenience and probiotic diversity matter most, Kefir takes the lead. So, where does that leave us? We must not look for one winner for everyone. Instead, we need to match each to the right goal. If your main concern is muscle, appetite control, or taste, Greek yogurt is your best ally. If your main concern is gut health, immunity, lactose intolerance, or mental well-being, kefir is your champion. But there is also a secret strategy. You don't have to choose one. You can use both. Start your morning with kefir for probiotics and immunity. Then have Greek yogurt later in the day for protein and satiety. Combining them gives you the best of both worlds. Science shows that variety in diet leads to better overall health. By using both Greek yogurt and kefir, you give your body protein, calcium, probiotics, and immune strength all at once. We have seen the benefits of Greek yogurt and kefir. But now, let us go deeper. Because every food, no matter how healthy, comes with cautions. And your health depends on knowing both the benefits and the limits. Let's begin with sugar. Many people eat flavored Greek yogurt. These small cups may look healthy, but they can contain 15 to 20 grams of added sugar. That is as much sugar as a candy bar. This sugar cancels the benefits of protein and calcium. 
Always read the label. Choose plain Greek yogurt. Add your own fruit if you need sweetness. Kefir has the same problem. Flavored kefir often has added sugar. While it still carries probiotics, sugar weakens its health value. The best choice is plain kefir. You can sweeten it naturally with berries or a small spoon of honey. Now let's talk about calories. Plain Greek yogurt is dense. If you eat too much, calories add up quickly. Kefir, being liquid, is easier to drink in large amounts without noticing. One glass is fine, but several glasses daily may increase calorie intake. Moderation is the key. There is also the issue of allergies. Both Greek yogurt and kefir come from milk. People with dairy allergy cannot consume either. Probiotics do not make milk allergy safe, but there are alternatives. Non-dairy kefir made from coconut milk or almond milk is available. Plant-based Greek yogurt made from soy or coconut is also an option. These provide some benefits, though the protein and probiotic diversity may be lower. Now, think about digestion. For most people, kefir is easier to digest than yogurt because it has less lactose. But some people may still experience gas or bloating when they first start kefir. This is due to its powerful probiotics interacting with the gut. Usually, these symptoms pass as the gut adapts. Greek yogurt, being milder, is often easier for beginners. If you are new to fermented foods, start with small servings, then slowly increase. Another concern is the strength of probiotics. Kefir has yeast as well as bacteria. This makes it more powerful, but for people with very weak immune systems, such as those undergoing chemotherapy, this may not be suitable. Doctors often advise caution. In such cases, Greek yogurt may be safer because it has a simpler microbial profile. We also must consider long-term effects. Both Greek yogurt and kefir reduce inflammation. Both support heart and bone health. But studies suggest kefir may offer extra benefits against infections and metabolic disease. A 2020 review in Nutrients showed kefir improved cholesterol, blood sugar, and immune defense. Greek yogurt is excellent for satiety and muscle health. Together, they provide balance. Practicality also matters. Greek yogurt is thick. You can pack it in a lunchbox, add it to recipes, and eat it as a snack. It replaces cream in sauces and mayonnaise in dips. Kefir is liquid. It is quick and refreshing but harder to carry. It works best as a morning or evening drink. This is why many people use both in different situations. So the solution is simple. If you want high protein and appetite control, focus on Greek yogurt. If you want gut health, immunity, and lactose digestion, go for kefir. And if you want the best health, combine them. Balance is the true secret. Now we reach the final stage of this journey. We have seen Greek yogurt. We have seen kefir. We have compared nutrients, probiotics, immunity, and digestion. But what is the final answer? Which is healthier for you? The truth is clear. There is no single winner for every person. Health is personal. Your goals, your digestion, and your needs decide which is best. If you want strong muscles, appetite control, and thick creamy texture, Greek yogurt is your ally. It is rich in protein. It keeps you full. It supports bone health with calcium. It is versatile in the kitchen. That makes it perfect for daily use in snacks, meals, or even as a healthy dessert. But if your focus is on gut health, immunity, and lactose digestion, kefir is really the champion here. It carries more probiotic strains, you know. It has unique yeasts and bacteria that Greek yogurt just can't match. Kefir actually strengthens the gut barrier, supports the immune system, and helps reduce inflammation. Plus, it's usually well tolerated even by folks who struggle with lactose. That makes kefir a healing drink, especially for people with digestive issues. Both foods also work together, honestly. Greek yogurt provides power, while kefir brings diversity. Together they really cover all angles. Strong muscles, strong bones, a healthy gut, strong immunity, a stable mood, and better weight management.
This is why so many nutrition experts now recommend variety. Rotate them, you know? One day Greek yogurt, another day kefir, or even use them both in the same day if you like. Science is clear. Variety in probiotics leads to resilience in health. Let us also remember one more thing. Quality matters. Not all yogurts and kefirs are equal. Choose plain, unsweetened versions. Avoid brands with added sugar, artificial flavors, or excessive processing. Look for labels that confirm live and active cultures. The fresher and purer, the better the benefits. So, the solution is simple, but powerful. Do not think of Greek yogurt and kefir as rivals. Think of them as partners. Each has strengths. Each has limits. But when combined, they provide a complete package for health. Now let me give you a simple action plan. If you are new, start small. Take half a cup of Greek yogurt daily, or one small glass of kefir in the morning. See how your body responds. If you tolerate both, add them to your weekly diet. Use Greek yogurt as a snack or cooking ingredient. Use kefir as a refreshing drink. Within weeks, your gut will feel lighter. Your energy will improve. Your bones and muscles will thank you. And here is the bigger lesson. Health is not about one magic food. It is about balance. It is about variety. It is about understanding your own body and making choices that fit your needs. Greek yogurt and kefir are tools. How you use them is the real key. So, next time you stand in front of the dairy aisle, you will know the truth. Both are powerful. Both deserve a place in your diet. And the best choice is not either or. The best choice is both. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like the channel, subscribe, and share this video with friends and family. Your support helps us bring more science-based health guidance to you every week.